tell how Indian somebody is by how many fingers they point with? I was born in North America, one finger. You, you, you. People from India, four fingers to point at one thing. Just see, see these bastards, see. Just see, see everybody, see. Just see, see, see. What Netflix does is it, it empowers the viewer. The viewer decides what they want to see, which is, I think, that's what YouTube did. But Netflix does that without having to worry about it buffering, um, without having to worry about watching this ad will disappear. You can skip this ad in five seconds or something. Um, it, gives, it empowers you as a viewer. You can watch what you want, when you want, for as long as you want. Uh, and and uh, network TV doesn't do that. They're like, here, here's what we're giving you. And people, are, and we live in a time now where you can go, no, I don't want that. I think the ratings speak for themselves. Just sounding angry. Like, I'll give you an example. If I went to India, there's over 200 languages in India. I don't know any of them at all. I know, like, a couple of greetings, but I don't know enough to get me in or out of trouble. But I know what they all sound like. And if I was stuck in India and I needed some help, I would just fake it. They would never know. I could be stuck in India in a market. I'd be like, "Hey, come on, come on, yeah!" <laughs> they won't know. They'd be like, "Oh my God, he's very angry." I don't know. Because of the internet, the whole world um, kind of uses uh, the North American accent as the base for what's normal, and uh, and then anything above or below that is considered funny, and uh, so slang and uh, and. Uh, uh, colloquialisms, they get it all. It's so funny because when I go to India, you would think that they're, they wouldn't get it. They actually get it better than they get it anywhere else in the world. And, and, it's not, and even if I do an Indian accent when I'm on stage in India, they laugh twice as hard because for some reason the uh, intelligentsia over there that does come to the shows feels that they don't sound like that. I can't tell if you're white or not. Um... <laughs> I'm working on a project right now with uh, uh, a friend of mine. His uh, name is William William Smith. Uh, it's actually Willard. I think Will's name is Willard. Is it Willard? Oh, well, we'll find out. With Will and Jada and Overbrook, um, we are um, working on a sitcom for me. And uh, I'm pretty excited about it. I've had deals before with networks. I've had three or four deals. And they obviously went nowhere. And, uh, and I think I'm through being disappointed by these people. And with a power couple like Will and Jada behind me, and uh, the writer who we can't announce yet, but he's a big deal, um, I think this is a home run.